Hey, what's going on guys? Chris here from Crypto Side Chats. I'm going to do a quick update here on Solar Road and the SOD coin. It's now at 1598. This thing's taking off, it's growing. It's still early. So I've been around the states here for about a month. So I just wanted to show you the price has gone up. If you're interested in still getting into it, I don't think it's too late for it. Matter of fact, I'm going to put some more money in it. I've only done a test amount of 250 bucks. And I did that about a month ago, roughly. And the coin was at $40. And now it's at $1,600. It's crazy. So they're really, uh, they're really growing, expanding. They're adding features. They're doing stuff. Making moves. So I enjoy it. Uh, it's not financial advice. Do whatever you're comfortable doing. But if you want to get into it, I have a link down below where you can jump in with us. Um, it'll take you to this dApp right here. And all you got to do is have money. And what I would recommend is in USDT on the Binance Smart Chain network, okay? On the chain of Binance. Make sure it's not Ethereum because they use the Binance Smart Chain. So get USDT on a MetaMask wallet, whatever wallet you want to use. Um, USDT on the Binance Smart Chain, okay? Get that in your wallet. Whatever amount you want to, to lease, we call it. All you do then is go right here to these top bars. You can go to wallet. So this is the wallet on the Solar Road deck. Not your MetaMask, not your other wallets. This is going to be the wallet within this um, platform, right? So you're going to want to go to deposit. This is when you deposit your USDT, your crypto, into the wallet on Solar Road. So pick your, like I said, just do USDT. I don't know why they have these other ones, to be honest with you. The reason it doesn't make any sense is because what they're going to pay you out in their native A coin right here. That's what you're going to earn on a daily yield, which is pegged one to one to USDT. In other words, it's pegged one to one to the dollar. So that's what I recommend. Put in your amount. The minimum you can lease out is $100, max, whatever you want. So whatever you're comfortable doing. So once you do that, say you do $1,000, you hit confirm. Go back to your wallet right here. Oh, oh excuse me. I'm going to put some more in later and I'll do it like a live um, deposit for you if you want, but it's pretty simple. So once you do that, you'll see your balance right here. All right. So if you put a thousand in, you'll see a thousand dollars USDT, which is now on the wallet inside Solo Road. It's not being leased yet. You're not earning a coin yet. Now what you want to do is go to leasing. This is where you're going to lease out your USDT, your crypto. For a certain period of time. So put in your money. Your amount, I'm sorry. $100 USDT minimum. So let's say we did 1000 right? And always put in where you're comfortable losing. I'll say this in all my videos. And I'm sure you've heard this from all of us guys. In the crypto world. And especially in DeFi. You got to make sure... If this money disappears tomorrow, you're going to be fine, right? It's not going to hurt you at all because it could happen and it has happened. You know, it happened again. It's getting better out there. The real bad apples seem to be getting filtered out, but it's not always just bad apples. The projects sometimes just don't work out. They fail, right? They were mismanaged. It just didn't work out. If the money is lost by the project, your money's lost. You're not getting it back. So be comfortable with what you put in. So this example, $1,000 token, USDT, because that's what we're using. Now you pick your days. 
how long do you want to lease out your USDT for and earn a daily yield in a coin, which is pegged one to one to USDT? You can do 60 days, 30 days, or 15 days. Of the shorter time period, you get less yield. You get 0.8% per day yield for 15 days. For 30 days, you get 1%. And for 60 days, you get 1.2. That's what I decided to do. So if you put in $1,000, and lease it out for 60 days, you're gonna be earning 12 bucks a day in the form of a coin, which is pegged one to one to USDT. And then after your lease cycle is over, you can either do it again or take your money out and move on. There's a 3% fee. So once the 60 days ends, you take out your thousand dollars there is a three percent fee uh, built into the uh the contract they use it to in a way to increase sod it gets kind of complicated but they use it as a burn mechanism so just keep that in mind as well it'll be a three percent fee or you can hit auto renewal and uh just have it renew when the cycle ends whatever you're comfortable with doing and you hit lease. And now you're leasing out your thousand dollars or whatever you decide to put in there and earning a coin every day. Then you could go to wallet. And if you want to just take out your a coin and get it back to your MetaMask wallet, you'd hit swap. You swap out your a coin to USDT, confirm that, go to the withdrawal, and you, you know, withdraw that back to your MetaMask, or whatever wallet you decided. Most of us use MetaMask, that's why I always say that. That's what I'm using. Back to your personal wallet. Confirm. That's one way you can earn passive income with Solar Road. The second way, is with the acorn you're yielding every day, you can mine the SOD token. Right, and that's what, this is why it's not really an update. Only update to this video really is the price of SOD keeps on climbing. So in my opinion, and what I'm doing, I'm staking my acorn to earn SOD. You've got four different pools you can get into. The first one, you earn 1.5% uh, daily output of SOD. No lockup period. The second one you, is 15 days you lock up your SOD. But you earn 1.7%. Third one, 30 days, 1.9%. And the fourth one, 60 day lockup is what I did again. And you can earn a daily output of 2.2% rate of sod which is which is awesome in my opinion what i'm doing you do whatever you're comfortable with i'm hoping sod price the way they have structured it is going to keep on climbing similar to a project that launched about a year ago their their growth token which is like sod went up to fifty eight thousand dollars will this do that i have no idea it has the potential to do it so that's what I'm doing. I'm staking my SOD to earn that yield in hopes the price keeps going. And I'm just keeping an eye on it. That's how I'm doing it. Um, it's going well so far, guys. Remember, a month ago, or r roughly r right around there, maybe a month and a half, SOD was at forty dollars. Now sixteen hundred, and just and just climbing. And there's different ways that they got different built-in mechanisms to make that happen. More people come in, the more transactions are done, it'll burn SOD. So it's, the supply goes down. To, when they get about 200,000, then they're done. 
So that creates an asset, right? Scarcity. You have a high valued asset, the price goes up. That's what I'm betting on. That's what I'm doing, not financial advice. But if you like the kind of stuff, hit that first link, guys. Get in, Solar Road. And that's all you got to do is you pick one of these pools after you earned your A-coin. And say you did the Galaxy like I did. And then you can collect your SOD. There's an NFT, which I'm still learning about. I'm not sure what this is about, but you earn that. You know, it's not free. It's by staking. You don't in the other pool. That first pool I was telling you about, let's go back. In the supercomputing pool, which is the only one they had in the beginning. These other three with the NFTs, brand new, is only a couple of days old. That's what I mean. They keep on expanding, innovating, and do, doing new new uh, ways to earn and new different avenues to go down. But in this one, if you do, do this one, you don't earn any of the stupid computing module NFT. The other ones you do. Keep that in mind too if you're interested. In, but I'm not 100% sure what this NFT does. We'll find out. But you're getting it, so what, what's the difference? I'm more interested in this, in this SOD going up and if the bonus is I get this supercomputer module NFT great go back to wallet here and then whenever you collect your SOD it'll be right here it just starts showing up you collect it and you can withdraw it back to your MetaMask wallet and that's it that's that's all you gotta do it's pretty cool the third way course to make some money with Solo Road and it's semi passive, it's kind of do what I'm doing here. You just spread the word, you're, you're referring Solar Road to people, right? You're telling people about it, and you can earn a percentage by bringing people into the platform. It's affiliate marketing, basically, all it is and by sharing Solar Road and make sure you're. You're in it as well. Matter of fact, I think they make you have to have a certain amount of money in this for you to even collect an, any kind of affiliate referrals. But sometimes affiliate marketing is kind of like a bad rep. Like we're out there just trying to promote stuff just to make money and we don't believe in it. Don't do that. The reason I, on my videos, I talk about different projects I'm in because I like them. You know, I think they're doing well. Yes, they're high risk. But the rewards are good. The company seems to be doing good. So I'm going to promote it and tell people about it. And if they like it and they come on board, I'll get rewarded and you'll get rewarded for sharing that with other people. And that's all it really is. That's all affiliate marketing is. If you're honest with people, why not do that? In my opinion. So you share, if you like Solar Road, say you get in it. And you make some money. And say, oh, this does, I like this. It's doing well. Just go share with other people. And you can earn referrals for bringing people into it. So that's the third way you can make money with Solar Road. You're going to earn your daily yield of anywhere from 0.8% to 1.2. Uh, paid out in the A coin, right? By leasing out your crypto. So you earn in that way. And then you can stake the A-coin if you so choose for SOD and earn the growth token. And so you can earn by the appreciation value of SOD. And then the third way is the, the affiliate side of things. I'll leave a link down below as well, guys. You can check out more details on the affiliate part. But as you share it and you bring people on board, they like it. They deposit money into the protocol. You can earn a certain percentage. So, say you bring in 10 people into Solar Road, they will use easy math. They put in $1,000, right? They're earning 10 bucks a day. If they do the 1% for easy math, they're doing 1% a day in a 30 day, you get 8% of their, their yield, I guess, right? So if you got 10 people making 10 bucks a day, it's $1,000, you get 8% of that. Just by referring people to the program. As I'm doing here in these videos. So 
that's it. That's the update. Solar Road or the SOD coin is just blowing up, doing awesome. The thing is gaining momentum and it's still early. So if you want to join us, uh, first link down below in the description will take you to right here. And just make sure connect your wallet and you have USDT on the Binance Smart Chain. It has to be on Binance Smart Chain. And just follow the prompts I showed you before. Lease out your money, earn your A-coin, stake your A-coin, earn SOD, spread the word, earn some affiliate income. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.